Welcome to learn full stack web development with React, Node, MongoDB and Next.js. In this course, you will learn to build backend API with Node and MongoDB. You will learn to build frontend web app with React and Next.js. You will learn to build SEO web app using Next.js, which is a framework for building React applications. By the end of this course, you will have built a production ready search engine optimized multi-user blogging platform. So this course is mainly about Node, React, Next.js and SEO. So let's talk about why we choose this stack and a bit more about SEO as well. So we choose Node, React and Next.js because they all use same programming language JavaScript. So even though it's a full stack app with separate API and separate frontend, we will be dealing with only one language JavaScript. We choose Node.js and MongoDB for building API because it is incredibly easy, flexible and easy to scale. We choose React because it is extremely powerful, performant and recently became so much fun and easy to use with the introduction of hooks. We choose Next.js because it takes the development process of React apps to a whole new level. It comes with server-side rendering out of the box and server-side rendering is necessary for SEO. Next.js starting with version 9 automatically decides if your page can be served as a static page or dynamic page. If your page is not making any request to your backend server to fetch data, then Next.js automatically serve that page as a static page. Static pages load extremely fast because they have static content. There is no need to wait for server response. So you can build your site's home page or landing page, a static page with static content such as a pre-written text and images to make it extremely fast. I have used Next.js professionally to build a web app and it scores 100 out of 100 in Google page speed. So it is extremely impressive. Next.js from version 9 pre fades the pages automatically behind the scene. So when the home page is loaded, other pages of your site is prefetched behind the scene. So when user navigates to different pages, it is lightning fast. With Next.js, all your pages are SEO. So either static or dynamic pages, they are all search engine optimized. And the best thing about Next.js is that it's pretty much React. You still create components the way you would usually do with React. There are only few differences such as routing and lifecycle method provided by Next.js which makes uh, server-side rendering possible. You will learn all that stuff while building this project. So if you are looking to build extremely high performance app that will leave all your competitors behind and stand out in the crowd, this course will show you exactly how you can build such app. This blogging app is built for production use and it is flexible enough for you to use as a one person blogging platform or a blogging platform for your business or even used as a foundation of a marketplace app because it has role-based multi-user blogging system in place. So join me in this course and start coding this awesome app together.